Good afternoon, chubby chums. It is day 52. Um, <clears throat> yes, still fat, as we always say. Um, but today, as you can see, I just had a I had an afternoon shower. I showered this morning, but then when I came back from walking the dogs, I thought, actually, I don't see another shower, so I didn't wash my hair. But I haven't straightened it or done anything because I haven't got time, really. I've got plenty of things to get on with. Um, there are two things today. So I keep getting a, a post come up on my... Facebook saying that they're going to cancel the female fat and 40 account um, for 30 days due to something I posted in I think it was May last year um, because it goes against their community standards now their community standards here they, they've lost the sense of humor because the post was it was a picture of Churchill doing the, the V sign and then it was a picture of let's just just go Pla because just in case they look at it and go, oh my God, you know, she said the name begins with an A and his surname begins with a H, World War II. And he was doing his, uh, should we say his sign? And the caption just says, never forget, scissors beat paper every time. It's a joke, but apparently it's offended somebody. Somebody has reported this joke, not even my mem, <laughs> someone else's mem, um, and someone's reported it, because Jesus, people need to get a fucking life. They really need to get a fucking life. Anyway, so that, and they keep sending it to me, I'm like, but it was May last year, and I haven't posted it. It's like you're attempting to post it again, so I've had to email them and say, I haven't been posting this, posted May last year, you have since removed it, what is the issue? They haven't cancelled my account yet, but I'm waiting to see, I'm bound, and this happened like four o'clock this morning, very bizarre, so I think someone was drunk and just got the ump, because they're a big old sissy farty pants arsehole. Anyway, second thing for today, <sighs> do-it-yourself smear tests, there's been like all this stuff, they're, they're trialling a do-it-yourself smear test, now I'm not being funny, that is the most god-awful horrendous thing to do when you have to go and have it done, let alone attempt to do it yourself. Can you see that be a complete fuck up when it be loads of people going, their partners, any chance you could shove this into me and try and get to the bit that you need to get to? It's gonna hurt me, I'm not gonna be happy, and it's absolutely horrible. Um, yeah, that's not gonna work. I can't see that catching on, if I'm honest. I mean, I don't like it at the best. It's like, we, we go, we have to, we should. Do go and have your smear test. I'm not saying don't have your smear test. I'm not convinced doing it at home is gonna work. Um, I honestly can't help but think that that's, that's just a fucking nightmare waiting to happen. <laughs> so that's my day. That's what's gone on. So I've offended somebody somewhere. And if you're watching this, the person that was offended, get a life. It's funny. It was just funny. It's just humorous. Um, and if you plan on doing an at-home smear test, I want to know all about it. I literally need to know exactly how you did it, what was done. Tell me everything. Okay, have a lovely evening. It's a bit, a bit of a longer one today. Uh, have a lovely evening. I will see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Day 53 tomorrow. Bye.